Hey, I'm Dom from Wondershare Unicom Motor, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to record your computer's screen and yourself all at the same time. You ready? Let's get started. Now, there are, of course, for basically everything, multiple ways to do this. You can record two cameras, with one record yourself and with the other one record your computer screen. That's, that sounds stupid though. Or you can use one camera to record yourself, uh, use a screencast software to record your computer screen and then match the two things together, sync audio, sync everything, which is a nightmare sometimes, and then just try to work with it. That's also a solution. Or if your computer has a pretty good webcam, which mo most computers do, like MacBooks for example, or, or good laptops that you can play a gameplay video on, then you can just use a software that will record you using its webcam and your computer screen using their entire, I don't know, software thingies that I don't really understand. Now lucky for you, the Wondershare Unit Converter has this function. The screen recorder tool that is built in the Wondershare Unit Converter can record you with the webcam on your computer and your computer's screen. And today I'm going to show you how to use this feature. So if you're interested, keep on watching. So first of all, open up the Unit Converter. On the left side panel, select the screen recorder. And then click on the screen recorder. Now here you can select the area you want to record. You can use a custom area. You can add the aspect ratio manually. But I suggest you to use the full screen preset because it will record the entire screen. And afterwards you can still crop the video but if you don't record something it's just not going to be there. If you move on from the left to the right you can select to record audio by using the speaker audio. This will record the audio of your computer. And then if you move on the right side, as we will want to record ourselves as well, turn on the microphone. You can use your built-in microphone or use an external one. And also turn on your webcam. If you have this turned on, the screen recorder will record your screen and you at the same time. If you click on the settings icon, here you can select the output folder, a frame rate, the higher the better, especially if you record a gameplay video, and an output format as well. In case you need to set a record timer, you can do that as well. And now obviously in this case you don't need to schedule the, the recording because you will do it manually as you are recording yourself as well, so you're there when things are happening. But once you're done with the settings, click on OK and select Record. Now a very important feature that I need to mention which can come in handy when you have an online course, for example, is the drawing board feature. Here you can features that you can use to highlight stuff on the screen. For example, you can draw a triangle, you can draw circles, you can use lines to underline something, you can, you can write something on the screen as well. You can use a simple pen tool to draw and you have the redo and undo button as well. And for all that you can also obviously select the color. It's a very neat feature. And then once your online course or online stream is done, just click on the stop button. Or if during an online course, for example, you wanna you wanna keep a break, then you can just click on the pause button and then go back to it. And if you want to edit your recording afterward, you can throw it immediately into the video editor or into the video compressor and keep working on it. But that was the video for today. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet already. And also turn on the notifications so you never miss a new upload on this channel. If you have any questions, comment down below, we're happy to answer. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching and I'm going to see you in the next video.